Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. Um, this is going to be quick. It's Saturday, December 21st. It's 3.02 p.m. Um, our sister, Crystal, out west of, let's see, where are you, Crystal? Nevada or uh, right next to California, where the mountains are. Anyway, she says it's a small town, and next to it, it's like a desert. She can drive it a little bit, and she's in the desert. So anyway, I, that helps she figure out where she is. Uh, anyway, she says it's still only 9 a.m. here, but any time it's time for singing praises. She's always sharing praises, songs with us, cert certain people. She said, wanted to say, in yesterday's paper, the businesses put in Christmas ads. Wishing everyone happy holidays and such. And one ad by the Ordinance Museum said, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. With a big picture of Santa, in parentheses, she put Satana, close parentheses, riding on a missile with flames coming out the back of it. The missile was white with a red tip and red tail end fins and written on the tip of the missile was missile toe like M-I-S-S-I-L-E dash T-O-W Santa was waving with one arm with green gloves, the colors of Islam. Well, it, well, it's the colors of Christmas too, but let me continue. Red, white, and green? Or does it signify the Grinch who stole Christmas? People who don't know what they're seeing will probably just laugh it off Wondering why such a weird greeting. Well, this is from, she said, the Miss, uh, what she called it, the Ordinance Museum. Okay, I'm taking that to, the ordinances are different kind of weapons and missiles and stuff that they've used in the past. If it's a museum, all right, uh, okay, why such a weird greeting? <clears throat> okay, had to share. I wish I could show a picture. It was blue sky behind him with clouds all around the circle of sky showing. I just looked again and just noticed there's a quarter moon showing on his right and a big star on his left in the sky behind him. About how it looks now. Okay, love and prayer always. Um, well, take it as you will. That's the ordinance Christmas greeting. It does sound weird. Is it an intentional message? I don't know. I can't imagine that a small town paper would... Well, of course, these are ads that places take out. And perhaps they, you know, needed to spend a whole bunch of money for a tax write-off. Because an ad in a newspaper in full color like that, they're expensive. <laughs> She has to say how large it is, still, showing the moon and the one star. There you go. All right, that I'll say bye for now. I'll talk to you all later.